Hoy, but I don't feel me free, so I chose him my tears. Maybe I'm the one I misunderstand. I mean, what type of country would take the actions of a few and blip out a whole civilization? I mean, thank God we don't live in that nation. I mean, what type of nation would discriminate its people and justify them as, a, as an abomination? Nah. I live in the land of the free, where I can walk in brightly light streets as those around me hold up towards deer, for I resemble fear, to not to succeed with foundations that keep tumbling down. See, I school the teachers to be outspoken, but that's not what I'm showing. I feel if I ever speak out, I'll be the next on the no-fly zone. I got a little cousin, he's on the same list, he's only eight years old. He's probably a terrorist. I mean, what do I know? But it's only half the problem. See, I feel for the brothers named Muhammad because only God can give them a job. History's turned the page. Because the last, I met, last time I checked, it was the black people that were slaves, locked up in chains, taught how to hate. But before them, it was the American Indians that got chased. But you're not American Indian, so you ain't gotta be afraid. And then it was the black people that were raped. But you're not black, so you're okay. And then it was the Jewish people that got annihilated. But you're not Jewish. So I guess you're okay. And now it's the Muslims that are slaves. But you're not Muslim. So what can you say? See, we fought for this country and still got condemned. Fought us was marching people who hated us, yet we managed to call them our friends. See, at first they would ask us questions like, if we went to war today, we should shoot us or shoot them? And such a radical cult that you think it as a joke. But how long can a joke go before you start to think, is this the only thing they know? I found myself at an airport for a victim by law to a so-called random check. They can see out of my idea that there are our stripes of respect, but they still give us the full frisk and say, thank you for serving our country, and expect me to take that as a compliment. See, I would agree that we get lost. They say you can be free, just don't build a mouse. But if you really badly want to, it's okay, just reject the Quran. I mean, we can understand it, so it's gotta be all wrong. Here's the solution. We'll have a bonfire, hold hands, sing songs, and we'll all just get along. Listen. There is terrorism, and there are terrorists living. But the last time I checked, terrorism and terrorists were not a religion. So for the last time, what do you want to say? Because you refuse to see eye to eye with me. If you want to know the truth, look at the foundations of my belief. In one dialogue, you'll hear my greetings. Upon you, I wish salam, which means peace.